On afternoons such as this, the mighty John Luigi Buffon must sit back and wonder why it all has to end. Last week marked the iconic goalkeeper's 40th birthday and he cannot have enjoyed many more straightforward afternoons than this during his 639 games in the Juventus goal. Buffon has actually been absent through a calf injury of late and former Arsenal goalkeeper Wojciech Szczesny has excelled. In goal but Buffon returned in the midweek win over Atlanta and he remains the heartbeat of this famous club. Juventus, 4-3-3, Buffon, De Cilio, Rugani, Venetia 46, Chiellini, Alexandro, Kedira, Sturro 46, Janik. Matuidi, Marcio 26, Bernardeschi, Iguain, Mandzukic subs not used, Pinsolio, GK, Szczesny, GK, Asamoa. Barzagli. Bentancur Delaware Sol, Lichtsteiner Goals, Alexandro, 9, K. Dira, 24, 27, Janik, 38, Iguain, 63, 74, 83, Bookings, Nun Coach, Massimiliano Allegri Sassuolo, 4 3 3, Consili, Lirola, Lemos, Acerbi, Piliuso, Miseroli. Magnanetli, Duncan, Berardi, Matri 59, Babacar, Ragusa 81, Politano, Biondini 64, subs not used, Pegolo, GK, Ajapong. Casada, Fratesi, Marson, Mazzatelli, Rogerio, Berini. Sensi goals, none bookings, Peluso, 33, Magnan Ethley, 86, coach, Giuseppe Iascini referee, Piero Giacomelli man of the match. Gonzalo. Iguain venue, Allianz Stadium The expectation is that Buffon will bring the curtain down on his magnificent career at the end of this season, but it is not set in stone and with Juventus in this form, temptation surely lingers. He made one save responding sharply to his left to keep out an early Sassuolo strike but that was the sum of it. Juventus were quite brilliant, racing into a four-goal lead inside 38 minutes in a display of stunning efficiency. This was Juventus' last home match before the Champions League returns with the visit of Tottenham in 10 days' time and this promises to be the most testing assignment yet for Mauricio Pochettino's vibrant young team. Juventus are imperious all over the pitch. With Giorgio Chiellini remaining powerful and controlled at the age of 34 at the heart of the defence. Alexandro raiding down the left flank and Gonzalo Higuain a ruthless finisher in the final third. The old lady of Turin are in spellbinding form, winning 13 and drawing two of their last 15 games in all competitions. Since losing to Sampdoria in November, they have conceded just one goal in over 22 hours of play. It is a stunning run of form that includes shutouts against Barcelona, Roma, Inter Milan, and Napoli. Who have all been kept out by the Italian stubborn resistance and a dreadful Sassuola side never appeared likely to challenge that record here. Another challenge for Harry Kane awaits. Massimiliano Allegri has guided his side up the Serie A table and this victory takes Juventus temporarily above Napoli at the summit. In truth, the win was assured inside the opening third of this game. Two set pieces set the tone. Left back Sandro, a long-term target of Chelsea, began the demolition. A scramble in the box saw the ball fall his way and the Brazilian finished coolly. German midfielder Sami Kedira then turned home a Sandro flick from the next corner and three minutes later Kedira raced through to score the third. Merle Janik, the conductor of the Juventus midfield, pierced a rasping strike into the goal on 38 minutes and Allegri was able to hand rests to Kedira and defender Daniel Rugani at the interval. He had already lost midfielder Blaise Matuidi to injury in the first half. The changes were no disruption to Juventus' dominance. The Turin side continued to create chances at will and Argentine forward Gonzalo Higuain had already twice come close when he then produced an immaculate driven finish into the bottom corner for the fifth. He added the sixth with another smart.